So Pastor WF Kumuyi of Deeper Christian Life Ministry has finally left his church in Nigeria and traveled to UK? A question. Now, before we continue, please do where to like this video, subscribe to this channel, and drop your comment. This video is going to be a little bit somehow. It will be uh, it will go against some uh, a little bit against what I normally do here, because I want to rant. I want to rant. Before I continue, please do where to watch this video. Well, I'm from Nigeria, but I'm based in London, United Kingdom now. Um, we belong to the Deeper Life Bible Church. This was Pastor W.F. Kumuyu interview that is trending on social media right now as we are talking. Many people have started propaganda against this man of God, saying that Pastor Kumuyu has left the country. He has abandoned his church in Nigeria and relocated to the United States. United Kingdom, that's UK. I don't know what this generation is turning into. You look at a man of 83 years. Next month, that June 6th will make him 83 years. He's still strong. He's still going around doing programs. You don't have anything to do but to pick him pick Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumuyi as the man that you use to run your propaganda. What is this world turning into? Now, let me explain this because I will share another video here, the full video of this interview, because this interview was granted years ago, more than 10 years ago, if I'm not mistaken, more than 10 years ago, when he traveled for a program, he was invited for a program outside the country. I went to that program and he was interviewed. You see him there with his wife. Then that, this lady, this woman was his new wife, was a new wife to him after the death of his former wife. She was a new wife, new bride to Pastor Kumuyi then. And they were in UK. You know, but now, as I can tell you, if you look at Pastor Kumuyi, this is the video, this is the current picture of Pastor Kumi, and this is a picture of him then. Does this picture look alike? I mean, does they look, look at their age, the freshness? This man was a little bit younger compared to this time. If you look at him here, he was a little bit younger compared to here. But people are picking up this without doing, verifying whatever they are saying, and saying that this man had relocated. They said that after giving us, uh, telling Nigerians that Tinibu, God will use Tinibu to feast Nigeria. Yes, now he has run away because they found out that Tinibu cannot feast Nigeria. There is the propaganda going on now. Very strong propaganda. And I think people should be very careful, especially when you are dealing with it's people that don't that don't come out to defend themselves, to come and play with you in the media. He can't come out to, he can't stoop too low, so low now, to come and argue with a dog. There's one man on this platform on this YouTube, Charles Abobi Aboki Abi what? That man has so much respect. That man, I'll be calling names. Don't. I'll be calling names if you know. If you don't want to watch my video, don't worry. If you are subscribed, you say don't, before you say you want to unsubscribe, you want to unsubscribe. No worry. Don't follow me again. That Charles Taboki is an elderly man. I don't I will not show you his video. He, uh, show you his face so that I will not create awareness, public do publicity for him. That man went to his channel and he talked rubbish about, pastor, about pastor, the person of Pastor Kumuyi. Why? How can you? And you call yourself man of God. You call yourself a clergyman. Even in that video, you clearly say you're a clergyman. You said it, you're a clergyman. But you are running down another clergyman. You're running down another pastor. The Bible said, a house divided against itself shall not stand. A pastor running down another pastor, where is your conscience? 
Charles Aoki. Now, I went to another platforms, Tunded Nuts, and all the rest, posting that video. That Pastor Kumi, when the pastor, let me just tell you, Pastor Kumi, you that people are saying that left Nigeria. This man, last month, April, was in Aba, Abia State, for GCK. That's Global Crusade with Kumuyi. The crusade he had been doing over two years now, going from one state, one city to other, the other, one country to another, one continent to another. Last month, to the end, beginning of this month, he was in Abia State, Aba, to be precise. And he was welcomed by the, after the program, he was hosted by the governor of Abia State, uh, LSOT. And the same night, according to the news, that man flew from Aba to uh, what the country, Philippine, and he held another program there. After Philippine, we are told again, we saw another another pictures and new in the news that he is now that he went to uh, what do you call it UAE. After UAE, after the uh, UAE, he came, he went to Cameroon. I had pro crusade again since this since this crusade in in Douala, Cameroon, Cameroon, and that program ended yesterday. That is 28th day of May 2024. That was when that crusade ended. He concluded that crusade in Douala, Cameroon. And this coming month, June, he will be in, in Abuja. So why do you people say he traveled? And after Abuja, he will come to Lagos and relax another program. We are told that he will have program even in River State. He's coming to going to River State. So why are people paddling, paddling fake news? Why are people paddling news unverified? Even that child, I'm just angry with that child. That child said, okay. Because that man said he's a doctor. That man said he's a doctor. I don't know the kind of qualification, what kind of certificate these people are getting without anything in their head. You can't do, a doctor, you can't do research. You can't do a simple research. Before you do it, you do your, pro, your post. No wonder Odumeji Ndaboski said, that everybody in Nigeria are illiterate. That even a professor a is an illiterate. No wonder he said that. Because even doctors that illiterate. can supposed to be doing research, whether doctor in medicine, doctor in academics that should be doing research, are not doing. I don't blame those people in S, those small children in S, because they are trying to they are looking for engagement so that Elon Musk will pay them at the end of the day. But Charles at his age is still looking for looking spreading something that is unverified unverified. You can verify news to let me just tell you Pastor Kumuyi has not left Nigeria. He's still based in Lagos but travels all over the world for programs. He traveled to different states in Nigeria for programs. He finished crusade in Nigeria here. Yeah, he finished in uh, uh, what do you call the state Taraba State. After Taraba, he came. To, he went to Aba. After Aba, he went to Philippines. From Philippines, UAE. From UAE to Cameroon. That he ended. He concluded yesterday. I believe he may be coming back to Nigeria today or tomorrow. And after that, in June, he will be hosting another crusade in Abuja. So what do you people think? Character assassination, propaganda, spreading, because you want engagement, because you want, you, you, you want money from online. We should do better. We should do better. Thank you for watching my video. All of us that are content creators, we should do better. We should do better better see you in my next video bye please go to the comment section and drop your comments well i'm from nigeria but i'm based in london united kingdom now 
um, we belong to the Deeper Life Bible Church. And uh, the Bible Church uh, started in 1973 by about 15 people, but now in Nigeria we are about 1 million in membership. And then we are in about uh, 60 countries uh, all over the world. And then we have the church also in the UK. We have about uh, 40 branches in the UK. And we are growing very much. Uh, and learned about um, Sunday and Elijah for a long time because, according to his testimony, you have all heard that I got converted uh, actually under my ministry. And in the first six months of his uh, Christian life, he was in the Deeper Life Bible Church before he traveled um, over here to the USSR at that time to study. 